Alright, hey, what's up, guys? It's GA Space 44 coming at you guys with the second video, I guess, if you can say, the Christmas weekend um, uh, collage of videos. Uh, the second one is going to be how to apply Grip Dip to your bat, or at least how I apply it, and the products, or I guess the company that makes them, and the, the what do you call it? The stuff that comes with it, I guess. I'm, I'm kind of mixed up right now. So, this is called Pelican Bat Wax grip dip a blend of pine tar and uh, uh, rosin let me see if I can focus it because I have my my bat right next to me there you go pine tar and rosin blend so basically what this does um, it's a very sticky uh, substance that you can put on your bat um, I like to call it thick and sticky uh, but I will show you guys what it looks like. This is kind of what it looks like. It might look a little blurry, guys. Um, it looks kind of like the pine tar stick, um, but it also looks very glossy. So I'm going to show you guys uh, what he gives you and how to apply it. So the first thing that he gives you <clears throat> is a little six thing of, uh, uh, I guess you could say scoops, and uh, that is used to apply it. I pulled one out just to show you guys how to uh, put it on. But this is not how I do it. I'll show you guys the way I do it. So basically the point is to be able to scoop it out. It's kind of hard with this. I'll just scoop out a little bit so you guys can see. That's basically the point is to scoop it out. Then grab your bat, you know, wherever you want it. And then put it on, place it. And because it's so thick and sticky, it's kind of hard to move around and apply it. So you'd have to apply it like this with the wooden spoon which first of all takes forever and it kind of sucks for me personally but I do love the fact that he um, the owner I think his name's Dave um, I'm just playing I know his name is Dave to uh, to apply it so at least he gives you something in case for those of you who don't know how to put it on or for the newcomers of how to do it so I don't use this personally I go to Home Depot and buy a putty knife show you guys a tag I left the tag out on this one hopefully I can uh, focus it so you guys can see it's a two inch putty knife uh whatever made in china 98 cents home depot not a bad investment for grip dip so what you can do is you can grab some you can scoop it out right now it's a little cold out so bear with me with the of how i take it out and everything it's a cold sunny day is the best way to put it so what i do is um i put it on and with this putty knife I can, if it's focusing, I think it's focusing on the floor, I can spread it around way easier with this putty knife. Don't worry, this grip dip is not going to look perfect. It's not going to look perfect for almost anyone. But this is how I like to move it around. I'm not going to take the entire video moving it around because it would take forever. It's that thick and sticky. So I'm just going to show you guys how I do it. Personally, what I do is I move it around. I move it around in a circular motion, kind of like that, like how I was just showing you. And the last step for the way I make it look is I smooth it out this way. Going top to bottom or bottom to top, whatever. And I smooth it out and it tends to look like that. Hopefully it can focus on my damn bat. I can't tell if it's focused, guys. Hopefully you can. But, um... It looks a lot more focused for me. Hopefully this helps it out, maybe. Sorry guys, bear with me. I'm trying to show you guys what it looks like, all right? So perfect, that's what it's gonna zoom in. So see, now it looks nice and glossy, nice and flat, rather than that, all these lines. So that's how I do it. I go from top to bottom. You can go bottom to top, it doesn't matter. And just apply it everywhere, gloss it out. Now, it is sticky, very sticky. Um, you guys can hear it. You can even see it gunk out. So what I like to do, if you guys can see that all over my hands, what I like to do because I don't like a very thick coating, I like to personally add rosin with my grip dip. And it gives it just the perfect amount of, of tack that you need without it being gunky. So if you don't like the gunky, um, you, you can grab this product just because honestly it's an awesome product 
but if you don't want gunk but you like the stick that it gives because it gives a lot more stick than the stick than the bat wax stick does um, you can just put some rosin won't stick just don't hold on to it and I guess you can say caress the bat or else you will get stick if you do this so um, if you want to take the stick off just a bit the gunk you can add some rosin it'll be a lot easier to put on just some stick where you can just hit um, your batting glove and then hold on to the bat so that is my video on how to apply grip dip or at least how I apply it the products that I use and the products that come with the the actual grip dip so uh, hopefully you guys liked it if not let me know I'll delete the video remake it see how that goes but uh, as of now uh, like comment subscribe and uh, follow me on Instagram thanks a lot guys